have seen right beside me, eye to eye, firsthand, as to how this administration has acted like this is a joke. It is not a joke. Lies are involved here. The Julie, my 13-year-old, she looked at me suspiciously like, what's happening to mother? <laughs> He's praying for a 15-year-old daughter who has run away from home. Pray for her protection and that the Lord would bring her back. We ask you today to pray for a daughter that she will be You know, be it's, it's almost like they can't start to think until you listen to their feelings. We have some prayer requests for ailments, sicknesses. We ask you to pray for a family. The whole family's come down with the flu. And then, of course, there's the story of my favorite whole TV show ever, which, let me tell you a story, okay? Was it best? Shut up, will you be quiet? Okay, now the story is about B.J. McKay, and this is my best friend, Bear. B.J. McKay, and this is my best friend, Bear. But the funny thing is, Bear... Isn't a bear. Bear's a monkey. A monkey monkey. He's a big monkey, but he's not a bear. So bear, not bear. B.J. McKay was, however, B.J. McKay. And he ran a truck business. And there's plots. And there are a lot of things I want to cover about B.J. McKay. bothering me. My mind is still back in that car with Esther's oh. daughter. What, what if she hadn't yeah. fastened her seatbelt? I mean, isn't this whole approach just a little too permissive? Well, but it wasn't, BJ! It was the bear monkey! Bear monkey fixes all the cars! 
Okay. Surprises and then me with a little a something. Story, so you just got and that kindles a hope okay? and an excitement no for you. and a deep sadness because it disappears almost immediately. But you see there's still a person that what you're looking at is this marvelous person who you've known over time and who is encrusted with an illness still surviving underneath this encrustation that seems to want to devour him.